Factoring Polynomials. We will first be looking at problem 1 on page 312. x cubed plus 3x squared minus 4x minus 12 equals 0. We will factor this polynomial by grouping. Okay, so what we need to do is group the first two terms together and group the second two terms together, like so. Then factor out the common factor in each group, x squared in the first group, negative 4 in the second group. What results are two terms, each of which have a common factor of x plus 3, so we factor that out, and then we uh, factor the second factor even further, down to x plus 2 times x minus 2, set each factor equal to 0, as you see here, and then solve for x in each case. We get negative 3, negative 2, and 2 is our solution. Problem number 5 on page 312. A cubed plus 5A equals 15A squared. We first need to get 0 on one side, so we subtract 15A squared from both sides, then factor out the common factor of A. Now we set each factor equal to 0. We get A equals 0 as one solution. A squared minus 15A plus 5 equals 0 as our next solution, but this needs to be solved further and can only be done using the quadratic formula. Plugging a, b, and c into the appropriate places and simplifying leads us to a solution of a equals 15 plus or minus the square root of 205 divided by 2, which cannot be simplified any further. This concludes the examples for the um, problems in 3.4 concerning factoring polynomials. Please let me know if you have any questions.